it already kind of set up for heaters. So, hey, Sam, what's going on, dude? Not much. How you doing, man? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Good. Um, all right. So, second fittest man on the planet is here to join us. The fittest dad on the planet. Yeah. Yeah, hey, and I'm babysitting right now. <laughs> you what? I said I'm babysitting right now. <laughs> Okay, so I got some. Oh, there we go. Now, what, what's the kid name? Tell everybody on on the video. Uh, yeah, it's Layton. Layton is the name. Layton. That's a nice yep. name. I like. Layton. Yep. Oh, Blake. Blake. Sorry. With an L. L a y t o n. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yep. Who came up with the name? You or the wife? Uh, my wife. Yeah. Did you Did you like it at first? Did it grow on you at first? You like this is it? No. Uh, so I mean, it took a while. To be honest, yeah, it definitely like grew on me. We had a bunch of girl names picked out that we liked, and then we had a lot of trouble finding a boy name. Well, and did you course. guys remember? Did you guys find out the gender beforehand? Oh yeah, yeah, we did. Yeah, Found so out like eighteen weeks or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, smart, smart. So you could like paint the room pink or whatever you wanted to do. Yeah, well, just the room's just white, but you know, we just that wanted was, to know. Uh, we're not probably having kids for a little bit of time, but Kelly's already picking out names. So oh, let me have word the name Avery. Is that a okay. boy girl name? I would think that's a boy name. What? Sam, you can't come around my wife now. I thought it was a girl name. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so we'll, we'll have a little bit of fun. I got some questions here. Some folks have been throwing questions in the chat. We'll go over them. And uh, <laughs> I guess first question, this is kind of a funny question. Sam, did yeah, you buy up? Hard Work Pays Off shirt from Matt Frazier? Oh, no. No, I didn't. What, what, hey, what was that face? Oh, no, no. I, what was that face? You don't want to buy Matt's shirt? No, I mean, it's a cool shirt. Um, <laughs> I bet they're all sold out anyway, so no. That's Did you buy a shirt? No. And yeah, I'm just going to put my eyes at that. Yeah. No, Matt. That, that's shirt. his saying. That's not my saying. I'm not going to go, I'm not going to help him out with buying his shirt. <laughs> Hey, so you did beat him. You beat him in a swimming workout, right? This year at the Yeah. Games? Just one workout, <laughs> yep. Is that, was that the only one you beat him at? Yeah. Mm -hmm. How did that feel? I felt all right. I mean, after getting whooped, up for, whooped by him for like the 10 other ones, it didn't feel amazing. But it was like, at least I got one. I'll take it. I think I could name like on two fingers how many workouts I beat Matt Frazier in like at the games. And I'm, I'm going to yeah. die. Yeah. Yeah, in the in 2019, I beat him on that sled workout, so I was really banking on beating him on the sprint sled, but it just didn't happen. But that one, looked, that one. Say that again. That was nasty, though. That one looked terrible watching that. Yeah, I mean, it was only a minute, so it wasn't too bad. You talking about the swim one or the sprint one? Either of them. Dude, the, 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 swim one was, the swim one is definitely the hardest of all of them, I think. But the sprint one was probably the easiest, besides, like, the handstand walk. How was it? Well, let's see. You kind of already knew you were you're gonna run again. I'm sure you asked a hundred times, but you already knew you were probably gonna run back because Maderos and Frank, how was it when you were just like, "What are those guys doing running back?" Oh, oh, yeah. I kind of figured it out at a certain point. Yeah, and I was just like, so I saw Fraser and Maderos pass me. I'm like, oh, it's just like a switch back, and then we're headed back down or something like that. And then I saw Adler pass me, and I'm like, hey, what's going on? He's like, we're running in reverse. I'm like. Okay, whatever. At that point, I was just I was just watching behind me to make sure I wasn't like last, last, and Brooke was still behind me. So yeah, that we're good. When he did that on film, because I was like, we we're like watching in the gym, like in our main gym. Hey, we were like <laughs> watching in the main gym when they did that. Everyone in the gym went, oh, it was yeah, like, like just voice. It was great. Yeah, and you know, you you went to the you went to the ranch 2016, right? Correct. So you, you know what the hills look like, and I don't think they show how nasty they are on camera at no, all. You watch them on camera. I'm, I mean, watching them, you guys run, I'm thinking, man, do they flatten the terrain out, and you forget until you're there, you're like, God, this isn't flat. No, it's, it's ridiculous, man. How, how far was it? Four, three miles? How far did you guys run? I can't remember. So all took, it was a 10K altogether, so a little over six miles. Three miles one way, yeah. And I mean, uh, there's parts of it where you literally have to be on your hands and knees because your your feet will slip. It's ridiculous. Yeah, were you seen or no? Yeah, yeah I was. Yeah. yeah, it looked it looked a lot steeper than I remember, to be honest, too. Yeah, it was yeah, pretty gnarly. I remember our turnaround spot for crawling up the mountain. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think we yeah we went through there too. Yeah. I think. Well, speaking of 2016, that was the year you. Uh, 
I remember talking in 2016 because you had whooped a bunch of us at Double D. <laughs> oh, yeah. I whooped everyone at Double DT. What are you talking about? <laughs> Not a bunch of us. Who's this, who's this young buck? Who's this guy showing up doing this to us? Weren't you doing, like, singles on the deadlift tours or is that someone else? That was me. Yeah, I dropped that was you. Yeah. Oh, boy. I, I love it. Whoop everybody, and then Sam came in and was like, mm, no, you're not going to. No, dude, we were in the same heat, I think. I think you were, you were chasing me the whole time. Yeah, I think I was way far behind. Oh, we were in the same heat as Travis Williams, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was us three. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was, a, that was a great year. Okay, more questions. If you have to pick your favorite workout to beat everyone in, not the swim workout. Okay. What would you Just any workout in general? Any workout in general. Okay, well, a workout that I know I could beat everyone in, but I don't enjoy at all is probably like DT at like 205. Oh, God, no. Yeah, I mean, I don't like it, but I know I beat people for like a few minutes on that workout. So if it's a workout that I for sure know I'd win, it's probably that one. Or something with a pegboard. But I do know you're pretty good at pegboards too, though. Yeah, yeah. Uh, sorry, you weren't. You didn't make it to the top 10 in 2019? No, I did not, no. I yeah, that was just you, no. Yeah, well, I mean, you could probably be, if you put, like, diaper changes in there, too. If you think yeah. about it. There we go. <laughs> hey, no, like, Travis Mayer would be your run for your uh, money. Yeah, he'd be, he'd be the one to be there, too. Like, Shoot. Go kid four now. I love that. I, see, I thought I saw that. Is he is he expecting another one, too? Yeah, I think it's, I think it's his first girl. His fourth is okay. going to be my impression. Um, That's impressive. Okay. Uh, favorite TV series? Oh, dude, that's a hard one. Um, does um, what's up? Um, I would have to say probably like um, I don't know if this counts or not, but Avatar: The Last Airbender does that count? That counts. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. As anime or no anime? Yes, yeah, anime. Yeah. Yeah. I thought. Okay. Last question. All right. Folks, some like, uh, what is your like fitness and or nutrition? What is like more successful in either of them? Different or the same, doesn't matter. What is helping me be more su most successful? Yeah, I mean, like fitness and or nutrition. What was yeah. like the coolest thing you did? It was like flip the switch. Yeah, I mean, I've, there's been a lot of moments like that at, throughout my career, but I mean, I would say this past year, working with um, Justin and CBG, it just increasing my carbs and even taking my protein down a little bit has helped me in like my second session of the day and just recovery type stuff. So that's been a big change big game changer this past year yeah cool my segue for those of you watching that's my segue my segue into so one thing we are here to talk about is sam and i teamed up with the companies that we're a part of so sam is a part of justin and consistency breeds growth which you can easily find on instagram or on sam's profile and then i'm part of functional eating um which you can also find on my profile too and we're a part of those companies and we decided to do something different this year um most nutrition-based companies, online nutrition companies, usually do, um, what would you call them? Like New Year challenges? Yeah, New Year challenges. New Year's resolutions, stuff like that, yeah. Yeah, they do New Year challenges because a lot of people have, they want to change things up or do new things. And so their New Year's resolutions or challenges usually are just like, hey, join this company, you know, join, just do it with RP or let's do it with uh, WAG or whatever. And it's just them doing it. And so we kind of came up with the idea of it'd be fun if we did it like company versus company, like eating versus cbg kind of like a sam versus jacob even though we know how that would end i would lose badly or like <laughs> what's your dog name sam? nara nara, nara. Yeah. so that's kind of what we're doing uh, if you guys are interested in more information than what that looks like uh, we've got information across our profiles and we're doing a really habit-based nutritional challenge we're gonna be doing some fun things i know for instance i'm gonna be leading a zoom class of showing you guys how to pimp out your pizza and make a pizza which Guys, I don't make pizza, so it's going to be – I'm going to probably burn the house on film. All right, but, Jacob, Jacob, real quick. Pineapples on your pizza, yes or no? Dude, my wife says yes. That's disgusting, though. <laughs> okay, so you say no, then. Okay. <laughs> what do you think, yay or nay? I like pineapples on my pizza, yeah. How about sardines? <laughs> oh, boy. Sardines, no. Heck no. It's a fish. Heck no. Yeah. Heck no. Yeah. But I am excited. That's going to be kind of fun to do some – some videos with each other, do some Zoom with each other, and just kind of help people. I think we're, we're starting it February 1st. Um, people are probably asking, why February 1st? It seems kind of, why not January 1st? We're going to give people time to, like, 
a lot of people will start New Year's resolutions. I mean, you and I both have probably done it. Where we start New Year's resolutions and then quickly don't do them because, you know, a month later we kind of forget them or renege on them. And then a month later we, we want some help getting back into it. So that's kind of what we're here to do. Oh, did I lose you, Sam? Did I lose Sam, everybody? It's a sad, sad day. Can you hear me? Oh, there he is. Yep, oh, we're are. good? We're good? Okay. Yeah. No worries. Um, all right. Last couple questions to close it out. What else do you want to talk about? Are you looking forward to the Open? Uh, dude, I never really look forward to the Open, but I'm looking forward to it being just three weeks, I guess. Well, what about you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. agreed. The Open's, Open's stressful, but having yeah. it, oh, like, yeah. it's over a month. Five weeks is so long. I know. It's so long, dude. So much stress. Yeah. And then, like, your significant other has to put up with you for five weeks, and you become a diva, and it's the worst. Oh, yeah, dude. No kidding. Why do you put up with a lot? So. Athletes doing the open. Hey, I got a question for you. You got a cat or no? What's up? Do you have a cat? We used to, but the coyotes usually get them. No. Dude, that's how, it is, with, that's how it is the with my parents' house. Yeah, that's how it is with my parents' house. If the cat lives, like, a year, it's usually good because it's smart enough, but doesn't look coyote bay yeah. We because of mice. They're great for having mice, though, for sure. Oh, yeah, definitely, definitely. Absolutely. All right, dude. Well, I'll let you go. Your internet's kind of choppy, but I appreciate hanging out. I'm excited to see functional eating versus CBG and see where Heck that yeah. goes. Yeah, it's in, uh, if you want to go. Say hi to your wife. Oh, I Sir, any both of our profiles, if you're looking for them. All right. I'll have the links up uh, later. All right, buddy. I'll catch you later, dude. Well, uh, Sam, if you're listening to this and you've already left, uh, your internet, uh, you need to feed your gerbils more because your internet is too slow. And those two gerbils running on that roundy wheel isn't speeding enough, though. <laughs> Uh, oh, what is winning on my back window? I don't know. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I hope you guys have a wonderful 2021. Hopefully it's better than 2020 ever was. Um, and enjoy the rest of your Thursday. In my case, a rest day. So I should probably go clean my truck on my rest day. What do you think? Anyways, have a great day, guys. Catch you later. See ya.